thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for the life your word brings. Thank you. I ask the Holy Spirit to lead and also bring me to the remembrance of your word today and forever. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Look at that, my princess, the most beautiful girl in the whole wide world. How are you? What is it? Is something wrong? She's been acting all weird since morning. One minute she's happy and the next she's sad. Oh, what is it, honey? Talk to me. Talk to me. It's on Sandra, dude. Hey, uh, Michelle, why would you say such a thing? Auntie Sandra is alive and well. Yes. Uh, you'd see her today. Uh, okay? Honey, I told you it was only just a dream, baby. Hmm? It's just a dream. You'll see Auntie Sandra today when you get to school, okay? Don't to mind, Mommy. She doesn't know how it is to get back to school after a long holiday of enjoyment <laughs> and so much ice cream. <laughs> Smile for me. Smile. Bigger smile. Oh, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Daddy, yeah. have you seen my bag? <gasps> <laughs> have you seen that? This is beautiful. Oh, who got them for you? Mommy did. She did? She got you the bag. I need a bag. Look at my bag. It's old. <laughs> Tell mommy you're not the only baby in the house. You're not a baby. Who says? Babies don't grow beard. Good for you. Honey, we need to go. We're running late time out. It's all right. Okay. You go to school and be a good girl. Right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. We need to go, honey. No, baby daddy. No, you need to go to school. Don't worry, when you get back, I'll get some ice cream. Listen to me, baby. You do not want to be late on your first day back at school. Okay? And as for you, start packing your bags. Your flight is for 12 noon. You're going to miss your flight. Oh, well, that's true. Mm -hmm. oh, don't okay. worry. Thank you. Mm. Okay. Like, oh. What is it? Mm. What is it? Baby? I have a headache. Stress. I've told you, baby, you need to rest more. Why did you drop Michelle off at school? Come back home and get some rest. Oh, honey, I can't. It's just... I cannot afford not to go to the office today. I've been receiving calls since 6 a.m. today, and it's a lot for me to do. I have to go to work. 6 a.m.? Yes. Listen, marriages are just going through a lot these days. You know, marriage is the only institution where you have two students who are chasing about 10,000 people. True. Why wouldn't the devil just step in and try to attack? True. Very true. It's really the sad. The Lord will show them through. That's my prayer for every couple. And the Lord will answer their prayers the same way. Amen. He's answering and hearing now. Amen. Okay. Honey, we have yeah. to go and you have mm. to go. Mm. Mm. You need to shave those beards. You're the only pastor I know with all that beard. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Second Samuel, chapter 10, verse 5 says, Tarry in Jericho till your beards are grown and then return. Pastor Taiwo, he always tries to defend everything with the scripture from the Bible. Honey, what are you insinuating? Have you seen what are you insinuating? Four? Have you seen what is in verse 4? I'll tell you what is in verse 4. <laughs> uh -huh. Honey, we are not in David's generation. Okay? Shave off those beards. Else I'm not going to kiss you again. Michelle, tell your father to shave off his beard. Michelle, the beard gang started with David. If mommy doesn't like it. I'll take it off. Shave okay. it off. I will. I already have a clipper. <laughs> Better. 
You better shave it off. I, I need clip up as it gets here. <laughs> On time, I hope so too. Okay, honey, we really need to go. All right, okay. come here. Mm. Mm. I, I can't you, get baby. enough. Okay. <laughs> so we'll Take see you later. I'll see you too. Safe Bye journey. Michelle. Pack your bags. Don't go late to the airport, honey. I will. Okay. <sighs> Thank you, Jesus, for a wonderful family. Please take care of my daughter. Such dreams. Why is she having such dreams? Father, please. Father. Father, I bring my daughter Michelle with you. If it is the enemies, whatever it is that is making her have dreams like that, I cancel and I call my case this. Holy the Spirit, I come against every enemy, every household enemy, every family spirit coming against my daughter. Whatever it is that dream makes, Father Lord, in the realm of the Spirit, I come against them. Father Lord, I say and I decree. Yeah, yeah, who's that? Me. Me who? Tyro. <sighs> oh, Jesus, thank you. Just had. No, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Are you sure you're fine? Yes. Yes. In the name of Jesus, I'm fine. Are you not attending the conference in Abuja? The conference? Abuja? Yeah, the conference. Oh, why? It's, it's, it's today? Oh, God. I, I'm so, I, I was preparing for it. I'm so sorry. I, 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 I'm in Abuja now. I, I'll meet up with you, okay? Please. Jesus. Actually, it's today.
guys are not here with the clipper yet. Huh? Look at my beard. Jesus! I don't think I need this clipper anymore. What is it? Huh? About time that you do this. Sorry, excuse me. Are, are you okay? <laughs> Madam. Madam. Madam, please can you? <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Easy. What what is your name? Juliet. Okay. Juliet. Please, I need you to relax and I need you to calm down. Okay? What is the problem? Why are you crying? What, what can I do for you? How can I how can I be of help to you, please? Take it easy. The, the, the Lord is in control, okay? Yes. Yes. You... You... You remember... David? You remember? David. David. Uh, which David? I, I know a couple of Davids. I don't know which David. David David! David, what did David do? Juliet, Juliet, take them. Easy, easy, easy. Come in, come in, come in, come in, please. Just come in. It's okay, it's okay, come in. Come in, come in, come in, please. Come in, come in. David! David is such a. He's a calm person. What is it? It's okay. It's okay to cry. Sometimes tears help you heal. And I'm sure you feel better. Before you came in, I was about going out. I have a pastor's conference at Abuja and I am running late. If you don't mind, whatever it is you want to discuss, we can do it in the cup. Oh, no. No, Pastor, it has to be here because it's not just about TV, but it's also about me, Pastor. I... I... What? Do you what? I... I... You, have you done something bad? You know, like have you have you done something to offend God? No. But I am about to. Why? Why would? Why would anyone? Why, why would you intentionally, willfully, sin against God to do something bad? And actions have consequences. Have you thought about the consequence of what you're about to do? How it affects you and other people? Consequences. I have a question. Okay. Why do saints sometimes fall? Yeah. 
with the ignorance to the consequences of their sins. Or perhaps sometimes it's a way to ease your eyes, feed your lust, fill your pride. If the only way to your satisfaction comes with a great consequence, what would you rather do? Sister Juliet, do you want us to pray? Oh, oh, oh please, Pastor. Please. Did the scripture say, For I will be merciful to all their unrighteousness and their sins and their iniquities, will I remember no more? Yes. Yes. He will remember them no more. Hebrews 8 12. God doesn't care about where you're coming from. God doesn't care about your past. He doesn't care about anything. Once you're with God, everything has become new. No, Pastor. Because I think God is so passionate. <laughs> because I don't see how that applies to everyone. No, no, no. God is not partial. He is never partial. Impartial. Romans 2.11. It is only man. Really? Really? If a man's sins are to be remembered no more, how about the one who was affected by the sins of another? What's in for them? Mercy? Or is she just meant to bear the suffering while the sinner just goes on and starts on over again? Sister Juliet, Sister Juliet, I understand. I understand you. Trust me, I, I, I know what you're saying. But the truth is, you cannot, as a human being, judge another person. It should be hideous to judge people because of their past. Because God can have... <sighs> Thank you, Holy Spirit. God sometimes gives you that life to live so that you can come out victorious. I, I don't know how to explain it, but it's divine. His ways are not the ways of men. Exactly. I like the fact that you understand the scripture a little. You have knowledge about the scripture. No. God will not punish you or force you or bring pain upon you to do anything. Free will. Choice has been given to us. It is left for us to decide. And when we take those actions, we have to dwell in the consequences. But we do all those things out of ignorance. We still Pray don't. with me, Pastor. I will. I will. I will. I will. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Please. This is Juliet. Come on. Come, come. Come, bring. Yes. Oh, Father, I thank you. I thank you. I thank you for your grace, for your mercy. I thank you because I was on my way out, but you have won this soul. I had a revelation today that I would be used as an instrument to change someone, to bring someone to you. I never knew this was your plan. Father, I thank you for this one, for your daughter. And I agree in faith with her that her Everything she has been going through. And I agree in faith with her. That whatever it is that is a burden upon her has been unburdened in the mighty name of Jesus. Father Lord, you are the God that writes everything anew. She will come out of everything a new person, a blessing. She will be fine like God. Father, I know that rewards are yes and amen. And once a soul has looked upon your face. There is no way you will not bring them to you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for this one. 
Thank you, Holy Spirit. Oh, yes, Father. Yes, yes, yes. This is wonderful. This is... Amen. Amen. There is victory. There is joy in heaven. Um, sister, thank you for, for, for coming, but I, I need to... I need to leave now. Huh? Please. All this, you should just, you should, oh. That's the time. Let me know what you're doing. You need to go. Hey, no, no, you need to stop. You need to stop it now. You need to stop this right. Stop this right. If you, if you continue, you will not like what I will do to you. Hey, Pastor, just no. hold me do some dirty things to my body. Pastor, look, look, look at this chain. Imagine, what are we doing in this chain? What are we doing? We're not doing anything. What is wrong with you? You're the devil that's been sent to use me. Oh, yes. Use you sweetly, Pastor. He you know, just me. bend me. He over, that is pastor. in me is greater than whoever is in you. I know the God I serve. Trust Get out of my house. No, trust me. Get out of my you house. Love no, no, no. You no. Love I wouldn't ask. I wouldn't love. Right on time. Hello? <laughs> yeah. Believe me, where have you been this morning? I've been waiting. You got my door? Hey, hey, is that for me? Give it to me. Give it to me! No! Oh God, what did I do today? What did I do? The package wasn't for you. Papa, I had to see you, ma. Oh, Jesus. How many are they? Six. Two women and four men. Oof. Okay, send them in one after the other. Okay, ma. But look, after them, I do not want any more people. Just tell them I'm not available. Don't feel good. Okay, ma. Mm. Doris? Ma? You know, I have been meaning to act. Don't you have plans to settle down? You know, husband, children, forever. Where am I? I'm walking towards it. Okay. You should. If you should fulfill God's purpose in your life, okay? Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. So please, no more people. Tell them I'm not around. I, I really do not feel good. After the six persons, I'm going home, okay? Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. to begin. <laughs> 
You know, um, life could be so cruel. The way your circumstances could restrict you from freedom of movements, freedom of speech, freedom. Freedom is. <laughs> freedom is often taken for granted. Yes. <laughs> Do you have something to say? <laughs> Do you? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why did thousands of people die during 9-11? Why were the Chibon girls kidnapped? Why was the life smashed from them? Why? Faith? Lies? Oh, lies! Because we are the orchestrators of our destiny. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh my God, you're sick. Oh my God. You're crazy. Listen, you're in your residential area. Whatever you do now, you will never get away with it. Because the police will find you. They'll find you. This one more part for you and you dead! Now that we are cleared, I believe you're on the same page. Now, no. that will be on the same page. I believe we are cleared. Please, there's money you want. I have some money. You, you can have it, please. Just leave me alone. Are you serious? Money. I'm sorry. Just, please, I'm sorry. Do I look like a thief to you? Do I? Money you want. Money you want to get out of what What do I want? Just tell me what to do, please. What do I want? <laughs> well, it's funny. It's funny to think how in life, just when you think you have it all, and the next minute it's all. Gone. Gone. All you've ever worked for, all you bells, gone. Vanished into thin air. Vanity. Vanity. Oh, I love Solomon. Jesus. Love Solomon. What is your mission here? What are you doing here? What's your purpose? Please, what do you want? Look. It's, I don't know what you're going through. But God knows. God sees you. God knows your pain. Just repent from whatever it is and give your life to Christ. Give my life to Christ? Give my life to Christ! How can you give what you don't have? How? He has made available eternal life in abundance. All you need to do is just come to him. God 
to him, all you that labor on him will give you rest. Just shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You were not listening. You were not listening, and that is the problem, Pastor Taiwo. You were not listening. It's not about knowing the doctrine. No! Sometimes you listen before you can teach. What if, what if, what if you don't have a life to give? No, tell me, what if you don't have a life to give? How? No, no, no tell me. How can you give a life that was broken, smashed, smashed away from you before you could even live it? What is life? What is life? What is life? You, you clueless. Oh, you clueless. You are clueless. Do you know what life is? Do you know what life is to me, Pastor? Life equates emptiness! God! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! For what? For what? For the fighting. Just tell me what you purpose this here because all this you're doing. My purpose, my purpose here, yeah. well, just think of this as a vacation, rather, vacation, just you and I. smell your own flesh. <sighs> Look at my face. This is a face you will never forget. Tell me, who am I? Never shot will die. You don't know. You don't know me. 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 I call you. Oh, boy. You want to leave me. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus.
said, look at me. Do you remember me? Do you remember me? You see, you perform me. To rush. You can't remember me. Look at me. Inhala. Are you asthmatic? Are you asthmatic? What is that? What is that? An excruciating death. No, you, you, you cannot die easily, okay? As much as you want, you will have it, okay? What? From you and your dead. If I hear the sound, you're dead. Ma'am? Um, good day. This is this Mr. That was um, yes, ma'am. My husband actually ordered for this. Um, okay. He's in the bathroom. Okay, sorry okay. for the lady. No, it's okay. okay. Are you trying to get a stranger killed? Are you trying to get a stranger killed? Trust me, his blood will be on your head. of your reputation what? What? Answer me. Answer me. How much is your reputation Oh my god, this, this was a job. She's, 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 don't make it. Don't do this. One more word from you. If you cough, I will shut. So just shut up. Shut up. To make it sound. your reputation to a place you can't even repent. Let Pastor John make a meaning of what I just did. Your wife, your daughter, your church will know who you truly are. You have a shame! 
You know who I am? I'm a child of shit! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You can pretend all you want, but deep down, you know who you truly are. You know who you truly are. I know who I am! Don't let death be you, you please. You still have a chance. Apologies. I didn't do a proper introduction. I am the devil. Is your mom not picking up now? Ah. Mm -hmm. Michelle, didn't you just finish eating a very big bowl of noodles? Mm -hmm. Ha! Don't tell me as you're growing up that this is a tiny tummy, that you're becoming a blue tunnel. Do you know what? Don't frown. Um, why don't I tell you a story instead? Hmm? Mm -hmm. I don't want stories. I want food. Okay, what do you want to eat? Chicken pie. Chicken pie? Uh, okay, do you know what? Eh? Let me keep trying your mom's number. On our way home, I'll buy you chicken pie. How about that? I don't want to go home. I want to go to your house instead. Ah! Well, let me call your mom first. What is going on? Who are you? What do you want? Hey, 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 hey. Look at you, your mother. One question. Tell her. Tell her. Tell Sammy, what is going on? Who are you? And what have we done to deserve this torture? This humiliation? What is this? Torture? No, but did you just say torture? <laughs> uh, uh, what I've done is merely a pat on the back. Because torture is when you don't even have words to describe what I have done. Torture is what I'm yet to do. Torture. My daughter, such a beauty. How, how, how could a monster end up with such a beauty? Life. Life is so unfair! Please. Such innocent formed from the seed of a monster. And yet you say God is impartial. Don't tell me. Oh God, this beauty. Listen to me, woman. You do not come into my house. Point a gun at me. Humiliate me. Torture me and my family. I will not allow any strange woman come into my house and take away my freedom. Hey! What do you want? I don't appreciate that. Just shut up! Shut up! Just shut up! Hey, please! Stop. Shut up! Stop! Clearly, I see that you're losing it. Uh, because I do not understand this lunacy. Take this lunacy and... Are you stupid? Take it from my house! Stop! Just shut up! 
Please shut up, Bob Ridge! Shut up! Please! 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 What? What? And you gone one more word for you. And you gone! You gone! you what is it what do you want from us what do i want who am i tell her who am i pastor Taiwo? i don't know liar bloody liar i don't know and you call yourself a child of a liar i don't know bloody liar do not talk to my husband like i will that. talk to you the way i want just shut up Even remember the ladies who raped you monster. Rape? Rape? God forbid, my husband is not a rapist. He's, this is Pastor Taiwo. He's, he's not a rapist. What are you, what, what are you talking about? Taiwo, what is she saying? Twelve years ago, at the University of Port Harcourt. Very young, brilliant, vibrant, joyous girl with so much dreams. Big dreams. But my first night in school was the last night I saw the lights. We got pregnant. And since we could not face the stigma of carrying unwanted pregnancies, my strange man, we had to do a push. Vivian. Vivian, Vivian, Vivian was a very fragile girl. She died. She died. And I under other hand and lost my womb. I lost my womb. And the man. And the man who raped me. The man who viewed my life. is married. A beautiful wife. A beautiful child. Preaching Jesus! Oh no, life! Life, 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 life is so unfair. Life is so cruel. Jesus. Every day. Every day I ask God one question. I keep asking God one question. One question. Why? 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 Sorry. I'm so sorry. Please. 
I was I was dreadful with someone once. I, I I did a lot of bad things. I, I just wanted to belong. I, I didn't know what I was doing. I was lost. But now I found Christ. I'm so sorry. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Madam, I am. I am so sorry. I cannot begin to imagine what you what you're going through. But you heard him. It was youthful exuberance. He has found Christ. He's sorry. Please just no, 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 just shut up. Found Christ. Found Christ. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Devil. Devil, what is this? What is this? Tell, just tell me this is this is not true. You know, I told you I was in a cult back in school. Yes, you did. You told me you were in a cult back in school, but you told me that you didn't do anything vile or anything stupid. That that, that you, 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 you 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 left before they, they could make you do anything mean or anything like this. It was in the past. This is in the past. This is in the past. Is this the past? Tell her, is this the past? She is sitting right here, hurting with a gun to our heads. She's going to pull the trigger if she decides. And you say it's the past. How is this the past? I'm sorry. Past. Past. Did you just say past? Did you just say past? Because this is my present. Ever since you raped me, Taiwo. Who would have ever thought this is what I will resolve? Who would have ever thought this is what I will I will, I, I will fall back on good in? Good in! This is what keeps me going. This is what this is this is what keeps my life going. Yes. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Like I said earlier. Look, I, I cannot begin to imagine. What you're feeling and, 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 and how you're feeling. However, you could have gone to the police when this happened. You could have reported this. You would have gotten justice. Why wait till this time? Report. Did you just say report? Do you have any idea how the justice system handles rape cases? Do you? So many young girls, so many young women, broke, shot, depressed, because nobody, nobody cares. Rape, rape is the only crime where the victim becomes the accused. Rape. I really do not know what to say. I didn't go through it, so I don't know how you feel. However, this is not the way to go. This is not the way to go. Just That's all I'm saying. Just shut up! Just shut up! Okay. Shut up! Have you ever been raped? No. No, I tell them tell me. Have you ever been raped? Stop. Do you know how it feels stop. to be raped? Do you? Stop, stop. Do you have an idea? Never know. Trust me, you never know. So just shut up. Just shut up. Just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Just shut up. Shut up. What do you even care? No, tell me, what do you even care? Because the only thing you care about is those that can splash money on your silly, your, your silly therapy session. Oh, I, I, I save. Lives, yeah, I can save lives. Yes, I did. 
you silly woman. You get uh, money from the government just in the name of I will run an NGO. You hypocrite. You bloody hypocrite. Yes, you silly woman. Silly thing. You have no right. right to say that to me. You do not know me. You don't know me one bit. Yes, I take money from the government for my NGO. Yes. But I have a family to fend for. I have bills to pay. I have people who depend on me. Still, I do what is right. I help people who need my help. I come through for people. I change lives. I touch lives. So you have no right to make me feel like I'm a hypocrite because I am not. Now you listen. Like I said, and I will keep saying it because I am a woman like you. And I know that Taiwo here and his group of friends, whatever, were wrong to have raped you and the other girls. I apologize. But I can help you. Let me help you. Listen, I would give you two million naira and free therapy sessions for as long as you want till you recover. And then you would get a new life. You would start afresh. All of this will go away. Please, let me help you. Really? I beg you, yes. Really? Oh, two million. Two million. No, 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 tell me. What am I supposed to do with two million? Oh, oh, oh okay, I guess. I, I, I'll just walk into a mall, um, uh, buy joy, uh, happiness and hope. But, 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 but let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Peace of mine is so expensive you cannot even get that on premium. Trust me. Well, this is still not the right way to go. Trust me. Just, 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 shut, shut up. Shut up. Or else I'll kill you. One more one and I'll kill you. One more one. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. through this together, okay? Don't be afraid of her. Don't be afraid of the monster that you created? Maybe that was 12 years ago. 12 years ago? It doesn't justify what you did to that girl. That innocent girl. You raped her. Tayo. Now listen. There is no time limit for crimes. You will pay. You raped her, Taiwo. I was, I was going to tell you. But you did not tell me. I tried. I wanted to. So many times I wanted to tell you, but I couldn't do every time I looked at oh, your eyes. Is nonsense. Nonsense, Taiwo. Now listen to me. You do not speak a word to me again until all this is over. That is, if we make it out alive, that lady has a gun and she's ready to pull the trigger whenever she chooses. She is broken, she is hurt, she's going through different kinds of emotions. Listen, our life is hanging on a thread, just in case you do not know. So don't speak to me again, Tao. Do, do not say a word that, to me. Don't do that to me. Don't. I need you now more than ever. I need you. You're my wife. We have mutual love. You love me and I love you. Mutual love? Mutual love? And yet you didn't think you should tell me about your past. The darkest part of your past, Tyro. I wanted to. I wanted to tell you. But I'm scared. God have mercy on my soul. God, please. I'm scared. When he came into her life, I couldn't believe how much God loved me until he gave you to me. A beautiful soul. You're so intelligent, kind hearted. You're the best gift any man could ask for. I 
couldn't believe it, but he gave you to me when I repented. But I was scared. I was scared for a long time. And on the long run, I realized something. That nothing was ever going to change God's love for me. Nothing. I need you now, baby. I need you now more than ever. God changed me. He forgave me my sins. He made me a new person. But how was I to know that my past was going to come calling? How was I to know the things I did? When I was in the world, it was going to No, affect me, affect my family. Baby, look at me. Please look at me. <laughs> look at me, baby, please. Please. this in one of your runs. <laughs> okay. Let's play a game. You have five seconds to answer all my questions. Else I would molest your wife the same way you molested me. But this time I promise you, it would be so messy. <laughs> Galatians 6, 7. What does it say? Your time starts now. You have one second left. Do not be deceived. For God is not mocked. Whatsoever a man saw it, so shall he reap. Fantastic. Bravo! Clever! Yes. <laughs> yes, yes. That, that, that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good one. Yes, let's try another one. Yes. Let's try another one. <laughs> Isaiah! 11. What does it say? Until the wicked boy shall be ill with him, and the rewards of his hand shall be given to him. Wow! wow just wow! Fantastic! Wow! You are a fantastic Bible reader. Yes, you're, you're, you're a faithful Bible student. Yes. I like it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yes. Um, let's try another one. Let's try. Just, just okay. Just one more. Just one more. Just one more. Just one more. Okay. Just one more. Um, Matthew twenty-five thirty-six. What does it say? When I was hungry, you fed me. When I was sick, you visited me. When I was in prison, you came unto me. What the? Which one of these have you done? Please, just... Stop. Just shut up! Oh, shut up! You saw me earlier today. I begged you for hours. You drove past me like I was nothing. No. Look where he led you. Back to me. Why don't you say what? Offering me two million naira. Tell me. Oh, look. I was in a hurry. I needed to get to the office. I'm sorry. I don't care. I don't need your pity. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. 
But Dean is not going to help you. It will only make things worse. It will ease my pain. That's drug abuse. I don't need your help! I don't need your help! Listen, I know life dealt you a blow. And I understand that you are faced with the helpless situation. And, and it's affected you emotionally, mentally, physically, psychologically. Listen, you need therapy. It's going to help you. Let me help you. I don't need your help! 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 I don't! I don't! I don't need your help! I don't! I don't! I don't! I don't need your help! Please do not need your help! I don't need your help! I am not one of those idiots that flock around you! No! I won't take therapy from you! No! Look, I'm not, I, I am not one of those idiots you brainwash with lies, rubbish, nonsense, lies! Telling them life is beautiful. No! No! Life is not beautiful. No matter how hard you want it to, as long as these monsters exist, life is not beautiful! It can never be beautiful! No, 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 life is not beautiful. Life is not beautiful. Listen to me. I am, I am sorry. But life is, life is beautiful. I mean, okay, yes, there is evil and there is good. But there is beauty also. And you will find it in some place. Okay, you're not the first person that I've gone through this. And you wouldn't be the last. I have a daughter and I pray to God every day that he protects her from wolves <laughs> like this. Okay? I know there is evil in the world, but there is also good. Lots of good. It's a beautiful world. You don't need this. All you need to do is just to find it. Find peace. Find the beauty in the world. You don't need this. Please. If I was your daughter, would you forgive it? Listen, I don't know. If this happens to my daughter, God forbid, I, will, I, I, I never know what I'll be capable of, seriously. I'm sorry. I tried, I tried, I tried, I tried, I tried, I tried so hard. I tried so hard to move and I tried to I tried to cover my pain with beautiful makeup. Beautiful clothes. I swear I tried, but it's a struggle, it's a struggle, it's a struggle. I'm sorry, okay, but I think you need to talk to someone, talk to someone that can help you. <laughs> Talk to who? They don't tell me. Who would understand that my life is a mess? Because some idiot decided to have his way with me. Who? Tell me. I'm sorry. Oh. How oh, I want to hug you. I want to hug you right now. So much. I want to hold your hand. I want to comfort you. I want to share in your pain. I'm sorry. However, there are people who understand what you're going through, through and through. And all you need is just to sit down with them and talk. And I swear you will feel better. Please let me help you. I beg you, please, I'm sorry. I'm deeply sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I 
don't need your help. I don't need you. Help! I told you. I don't need your help. No, look around you. Look around you. The only people I see that need help right now is you and your monster of a husband. Now, now. Back to the game. Second final. Get him starting. What does it say? Your time stands now! A man came to her. And because he was stronger than her, he raped her. He raped her. <laughs> I regret that night. Always. Always since things began to No, you did not. Nor will I regret violating you. Shush. Shush. Shut up! Just shut up! Shut up! Shush. What about your parents? What about them? Just curious. Did you by chance let him know about this or maybe any of your loved ones? I told my mother, but she blamed me for that. Do you know what she said to me? My mother told me I put myself in that position. How did I put myself in a position to be raped? Parents are the number one reason why we don't even report such cases. But anyways, I'm, 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 I'm all grown now. And I can sort myself out, so thank you. You claim you can handle yourself and take care of things. But look at you, sitting down here and seeking revenge in the most barbaric way. Hmm? Uh, trust me, I am doing God's work. Because that man is just somewhere so busy taking care of all the pressing matters. Yes, I'm doing his work. <laughs> You know, it's so funny how you think about God. You think God is some big old man who is very mean hearted. And once you do any wrong, he strikes you out and looks the other way. Hmm? How else am I supposed to think of a God who sits there and watches suffer so much? I just stay there and expect him to serve him. How? Huh? How? Because God is God. God can turn your ashes into beauty. God can make you whole again. Look, whether you believe or not, whether you love God or not, God will still be God forever. And he loves you regardless. Rubbish! Nonsense! Love does not exist. Oh. Not on earth. Not even in heaven. Oh. It's so sad how ignorant you are. God is love. <laughs> God is love. And for you to know this love and feel this love, you must have to know God first. Shut up! That's what you need. Numbers. 3519. What does it say? You have one second left. And the Avenger 
shall deliver the slayer out of the hand of the revenger of blood. Well, Aunt, you quoted verse 25 instead of 19. So, well, answer. Okay. Revenge of blood himself! Oh, Lady Mother. When he meets him, he will kill him. How oh, sorry. Sorry! The force already killed him. Wait, wait, we have more time. You said it was five seconds. I have four more. Well, there is no second chance in! No! <laughs> see, see, see. Ah. Oh! Ah. Oh! 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 So, Juliet, what is for you after school? I need to major in business law. Now, me, there's too much wickedness in this world. As in, that's right. Ah. <laughs> Vivian, I found the man to rape. make any difference anymore. You've killed my wife. But you're going to kill me next. Then your daughter. No. No. No, please. Not Michelle. She's innocent. Don't hold her responsible. Don't let her pay for the sins of her father. Please. 
Jesus, let her be the only good legacy I have. Why did you do it? Why did you do it? Why? Why? Why did you do it? Why did you do it? She's innocent. in trouble back then in school with some boys and then my friend advised me that I joined his confraternity he asked me to belong I thought it was going to be a piece of cake but When I joined today, the, they gave me an assignment to, to say to test my loyalty. What happened to you was not part of the plan. It wasn't my intention. But when we got there, Men they walk, occupy the sleep. Who is this? Taiwo. Who is this? One chill with the big guys. One to bamba. Every big move, they start with a step. That's the starting point of this. After they look you so, enter that bed, lap them. Ah, please. Please, please. please. You don't care? No, no, no. I don't talk, you don't talk. Mama, you, you want to collect? I got to do something. Please, please, please. Okay. Love me two of them. Two of them. Please, please, please. Please, please. Please, please. Please, please. I wish I knew what I knew now then. I wish so many times that I could turn back the hands of time and right most of the wrongs I did. Look, please. I am sorry, Juliet. I did this. I inflicted the pain on you. Stella doesn't deserve this. Neither does Michelle. Beef is with me. I don't know how much pain. I can't say I can feel your pain. How you navigated all these years. Knowing that you couldn't give birth. The trauma I put you through. I can imagine the pain. That's all I could do. But one thing I know for sure is it's never too late. Don't be crap! Not bring back to past. It's never too late. Your regrets will not bring back my womb. Your regrets will not bring back Vivian. It's never too late. Please. I know because God found me. He took away my sins. He made me new. He can do it for you too. Come to me, all of you that labor, and I will give you rest. He is open to make you start afresh. You can start a new life. You can heal. Leave again. I have seen him do it countless times. Maybe all this that happened to you in the past, to you today, while you're here, is so that you can find your redemption. You. 
You will smell old flesh roasting. Your eye sockets will burn to ashes. That will be my redemption. Hello. <laughs> and you must be Michelle. Oh, how are you? Who are you? Oh, but it's okay, I forgive you. I, I know you were so liberal when I went to the US. Trust me, I am your Auntie Juliet. Look at you all grown, you even have your mother's eyes. You're so cute. <laughs> and you must be Auntie Sandra, right? Yes, yes, I am. Oh my goodness. I have heard so much about you. Everything good, trust me. <laughs> Thank you for all you do. You know, every parent needs a teacher like you. I can't wait for nine months to bring my kids to you. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you so very much for the compliment, man. I really appreciate it. Yeah. But you know, her mom's and dad number was not going through. That was why I decided to bring her home. Oh, that's so thoughtful of you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Actually, it's been a busy week, but it's fine. I'll take it from you, okay? Um, so, um, come, baby, let's. Uh, oh, you, you. Ex let's excuse go. me, excuse me, uh, sorry, excuse me. Let's go. Ex excuse me, ma, please. Can I at least say hello to her parents? Her parents? They actually traveled to um okay the mom no okay she she actually traveled you know uh, yes 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 they're not home she, um, she traveled no offense but I saw her mom's car parked outside oh yeah her mom's car mm -hmm. um actually she traveled to the north you know she can't actually drive to the north in all these things oh yes uh, excuse me ma'am I'm so sorry but I'm very much aware that the dad traveled to the north but. How possible will the mom also travel without even informing the school? Um, like I said, it's been a very busy week, okay? Um, so, you are no home. Let me take it from you, okay? It's fine. And uh, baby, let's go. Uh, and please, Ma, you're hurting the child, please. Okay, bye. Hey, Jesus. Listen to me, you need to be strong for me, okay? Can you no, on time? Why are you on it here? What is wrong with me? I don't have time to explain. We don't have time, Michelle. Please, I need you to be strong for me. Can you on time me? Oh, please, okay. Hurry, hurry. Just look for the Lord. Yeah. Hurry, hurry, hurry. It's loose already. I've been pushing it. Hurry. Hurry. Please, hurry. from me, okay? Go!
Do you say? I need you to send some people to my house. It's urgent. Yes, the estate you saw me the last time. Vera Estate. Number 22. Vera Estate. Okay. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh my god. He looks so happy. Oh my god. He looks so happy. I'm in a better place now. I'm so happy for you, my friend. You know what? I found that monster. He now has a wife. He even has a daughter. I I had him not not long ago. Until am I dead? Where is this place? Your way of always been. You didn't leave. What? You stayed in the past. No. That's not true. Vivian, that is not true. We both left. We left, remember? We left when that thing happened with the monster. We left together. Please give me the keys. Where are the keys? Where is the key, Vivian? Please give me the key. I don't have them. Vivian, what do you mean you don't have the keys? I always give you the keys. Please give me the keys. Okay, fine. Call someone. Call anybody. Please. I need to leave this place. I need help. Please help me, Vivian. Help me. Please help me. Please help me. Please help me. Because I don't know. I don't know where the keys are. Madam, you're under arrest for the murder of Miss Sandra and the attempted murder of the Taiwos. Pastor Taiwo, you know you have to come with us to the station for some questioning. Take her away. Move, madam! Let's go. Move! Move! Sorry, madam. It'll be all right. Is that Sandra dead? Uh, no. No. Madam, are you aware of your husband's little secret? Also, madam, is it true you sued your husband over an accident that happened 12 years ago? Um, you can agree with me that I've answered enough questions today. So please, enough of all these questions. They are becoming too ridiculous. And if you don't mind, I would like you to take your leave. Please. Doris, um, please come. Um, kindly show them the way up, please. Thank you. Thank you for having us, madam. You're welcome. Thank you very much, madam. You're welcome.
Madam, the news of the arrest of Pastor Taiwo for the rape of Juliet and Vivian is all over the place. I suggest you should avoid the press for now. Thank you, Doris. Okay, ma. Mercy on my family. We need you at this time, Lord. We need your help at this time. This is too much. It's a lot. I commit I will into your hands at this time. I say, Father, help him. Help him, Lord Jesus. Give him peace. Help him, Lord Jesus. Help us, Lord. Help us be our defender at this time. In Jesus' name, amen. Madam, I was in court yesterday. I really tried my best as his lawyer. But unfortunately, he was sentenced to prison for eight years. You know, the law states that uh, any rape case is usually 12 years. But because of his philanthropic nature in the society, as a pastor, it was reduced to eight years. I didn't see you in court yesterday, and I decided to come and give you the situation report. Thank you so much, Barrister. Thank You're you welcome. for all that you did. I know that you fought and fought and fought. Thank you. You know, I watched the news yesterday, and I listened to everything. I saw how they took him away and everything. However, I couldn't bring myself to court. I couldn't stand watching my husband being taken away like that. I already knew what it was going to be. I mean, it's a rape case. You always go to jail, you know. However, I'm thankful to God that, like you said, because of his philanthropic nature, it was reduced to eight years. We we'll just keep praying to God that God keeps him and sustain him until this time is, 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 is past, you know. However, my daughter and I will visit him from time to time in prison. It's okay. Yeah. Please take care of yourself and your daughter. Thank you so much, Barista. You're welcome. Please let her bring you something else. I'm want. okay with the water, no problem. Okay. <sighs> welcome back. Yeah. <laughs> Home sweet home. <laughs> Come here. Mm -hmm. Feels so good to be back. I know. Please sit. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for being with me back. Amen. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry that you had to go through everything you went through. No. No. I'm the one who's sorry for what I put you through. Mm. And what I put Michelle through. That's true, Michelle. <laughs> She's with her grandma. She's been there for two days now. I'll pick her up later. I also owe her an apology. I'm so sorry. It's okay. Going to jail was for a reason. Mm. <laughs> the miracle of being free early because they had to decongest in those prisons was, mm. I knew it was God. Yeah. Indeed, it was God. And while I was in prison, there were so many souls that came back to I knew he sent me there for a reason. So much people than even when I was outside prison, give their lives to Christ. Mm. 
was visiting it with me. So everything that happened was from apartment stores. Absolutely. Thank you, Chief. I just pray. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you for bringing back my husband in one piece. Feeling better? What can I say? God is good. Oh, God is great. <laughs> God is absolutely amazing. God Amen. is awesome. I mean, look. <laughs> Who could have thought that you wouldn't even spend up to three years in there? With the congestion of the prison and everything. They decided to let some people go on the pardon. Yes. Look, God is just amazing. I don't know how he does these things. He wants me to continue absolutely. in the journey. I feel like he, he just answered my prayers. I don't know how that happened, but it worked out. Do not worry, okay, honey? In no time, you will get back on your feet again and everything will be fine. Okay? <laughs> Thank you for everything. Welcome, Dad. God bless you. <laughs> Amen. I have a surprise for you, Dob. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Doris! Please send in the new girl. Thank you. That's the title. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Juliet. Yes. <laughs> oh, it's so good to see you. Good to see you too, Pastor. What are you doing here? Well, I'm here. Ah, please, sit. Thank you. <laughs> you know, after the therapy sessions, just that um, she joined the company and be a source of inspiration to all the young ladies who have gone through the same thing like her. Yeah. And she has been amazing. Thank you. She, she has really <laughs> touched a lot of lives. Oh Thank no, you, you so have much. been. This is good. This is good. It's good to see you again. It's been good. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank you for making all this possible. <laughs> God is amazing. God is great. I tell you. So how are you doing there? <laughs> What happened? Some boys told me today for story to do. Oh my god. Shoo, 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 sh